difference between make sure, ensure, and make it a point. Are you wondering if there's a difference between make sure and ensure? We also have the expression make it a point. I'll teach you how to use each one in this lesson. There's no difference in meaning between make sure and ensure. It's just that ensure is more formal. When speaking, we typically use make sure. If writing a more formal article or business text, we would use ensure. Here are a few examples. Please make sure we have enough copies of the report for everyone in the meeting. This is the same as, please ensure we have enough copies of the report for everyone in the meeting. I left early to make sure I could get to the airport on time. Or, I left early to ensure I could get to the airport on time. Make sure and ensure are the same. To make it a point to do something, or make a point of doing something, means to make a deliberate effort to do something, or to do something specifically so that people can see it, because if you don't do it, something bad will happen, or people might think badly of you. For example, I make it a point to treat all my employees fairly. This means I consciously and deliberately take this action on purpose. She made a point of inviting the entire family to the party. This means she deliberately invited everyone because others might think badly of her if she excluded some people from the invitation. Note that these two expressions are the same, but after make it a point, we use the to form of the verb. I make it a point to treat all my employees fairly. And after make a point of, we use the ing form of the verb. She made a point of inviting the entire family to the party. If you're not sure which English word to use, then it's impossible to speak English confidently. My ebook, 600 Plus Confusing English Words Explained, can help you understand these difficult words better. Click on the link in the video or in the description for more information. Each lesson has a clear explanation with examples so that there will be no doubt in your mind how to use the words correctly. Again, click on the link to see the full list of confusing words covered in the ebook.